The reason why I said distractions for the ones who are slightly older, sometimes Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala tests us with some distractions. And sometimes shaitan comes and he makes us distracted. We start looking at other people's lives and talking about other people in a negative way. Big people do that too. Young people do that too. Don't make little circles and take out one girl and say, no, she's not in my group. She's not in our group and you make it tough for her. I'm giving you a real life example. You know, the same thing happens with boys. This guy is not in our circle. He's like this, like that. So what? We pick on someone. We say nasty words to them. We tell them how ugly they are when they're not really ugly. We're the ones who are ugly because the only people who are ugly are the ones who call others ugly. It's the ugliness that makes you say someone else is ugly. So don't say that because in the eyes of Allah, He created us all beautifully. So therefore, don't ever call someone else in a bad way to hurt their feelings. You're going to grow old. You know, when I was at the University of Medina, we had some friends and a lot of them became ministers, prime ministers, top notch people across the world. And when I sit and think, wow, this guy used to sit right next to me. I have colleagues who are Imams of the Haram, Imams of the Haram studied with me. And I'm thinking to myself, gosh, we didn't even know that this guy is going to graduate and become someone really that we would be embarrassed that one day we had a fight with him. I I'm not saying I had a fight with anyone, but I'm giving an example, right? So the same applies. I'm giving you the same lesson to say, make life easy for others, speak with respect, give people, you know, good vibes, not bad vibes, inshallah.